this video is over what determining if a graph is linear or nonlinear. Just as a reminder, the word linear is representative of a straight line. And when it's a straight line, it has to be a perfectly straight line. No curves, no stops, no starts. It's just one continuous straight line. The word nonlinear references not straight lines. So if the graph has any curves, any points, anything like that, it would be not a straight line. For number one, it is nonlinear because that graph curves. It is not a straight line. For number two, even though the graph is in points, if you were to connect the dots, it would make a perfectly straight line. And so it is linear. For number three, that is a perfectly straight line. There are no curves, bumps, or points, and so it is linear. For number four, this is not a perfectly straight line. You can tell that it starts to bend here in the middle, and so it is a nonlinear graph. Number five is also a nonlinear graph because that is not a straight line. There is a curve in the graph. And so it is nonlinear. For number six, even though there are two straight lines here, it is nonlinear because here in the center, the graph changes direction. And so it is nonlinear. Remember, linear has to be a perfectly straight line. No curves, no bumps, no changes. Perfectly straight. That is not a straight line. For number seven, that is a perfectly straight line. There are no curves, no bumps, no changes, and so it is a linear graph. For number eight, number eight is a curved graph, so it is nonlinear, not a straight line. And number nine, the last one, even though each piece is straight, it is not a continuously straight line, and so it is nonlinear.